Well, hello there, everybody, and welcome to my desktop. <laughs> All right, today's video is going to be um, a little bit different. I'm going to teach you how to set up a client, your Minecraft game. How I want to teach you how to set that up to log on to a modded server because our server is going modded. Uh, yeah, so it's really easy. Let me just show you. Let me just show you how to do it. Um, first, you're going to have to download a client called uh, MultiMC. It's open source. It's safe. I trust it. A lot of people use it. Uh, and if you're paranoid, you can look at the code and see exactly what's going on in there. Um, so I'll, you know, I'll I'll put this link here in the description of this video, and I'm also going to put the link for all of the various mods that you're going to need to download as well. So before we even get started, click on all of the links below and download everything. Um, you're going to need a total files. You're going to need this many files. Um, so a little bit of work to do. Uh, you don't need Optifine, but I install Optifine and I want to teach you how to do it. Um, so when you're on this web page, go on down here and click on download multi MCI in Windows. So it's gonna give you the ad fly, you know how to do it. Just unzip it somewhere and extract it and then run it. That's all you do. And then this will pop up once you run it. Now remember you've already downloaded all of the mods that you're gonna need have them on your desktop or somewhere where you can get to them um, basic computer control here people all right um, this is what I made earlier so I'm gonna make a new one right now so we're going to hit this arrow and create a new instance this is going to be for the Niseros nation server modded server okay great I got a new icon let's uh, change it to something cool TNT Okay, and uh, what you want to do is go down to Edit Mods. Um, this screen is going to sh going to pop up. Minecraft Jar Mods and Resources. Uh, what we're going to do is very easy. Uh, go ahead and get your folder with all of the mods that you want, and then all you do is drag and drop them. The first, but, but the the order is the important part. So so watch this. Okay, first take Mod Loader. Make sure you're on Minecraft that jar, the first tab here, and just drag it over. So that's number one. The second one you want is Minecraft Forge, and it, it needs to go underneath it. Not like this. Like this. Okay, does that make sense? Um, and then, if you want Optifine, that goes last. These are the only three that you want in the Minecraft jar. Next, click on mods or the Minecraft slash mods. All of the rest need to go in here. We'll do industrial craft first. And then this is kind of important. Do red power core. And then you can do the other red powers. Core, I think uh, never mind. I don't think I don't think it matters. So just do all of these. And get them all in there. Okay. So we have industrial craft, we have red power, all seven of the red powers. We have iron chest, and then we have the compact solars, which is an add-on to industrial craft. Okay? Makes sense? And then Inside here are the other three, and, and we don't need to touch those. Okay, don't don't need to do any resources. You're done. You're you're done. Just just close it, and that's it. Um, you can play, and then it's gonna ask for your name and password. Um, don't need to do this, but you can. You can safely do this. Uh, so put in your stuff and. Log in. It's going to log in and then build build your jar and stuff here in a second. 
Oh, you know what? Currently the Minecraft servers are down, so I should then play offline. Hold on. Okay, here we go. It's gonna download the uh, the the proper. It's downloading the the Minecraft packages, and then it's gonna install the mods, and it's gonna do everything automatically. Kaboom. Okay, it works. Minecraft 1.2.5 options. Let's see here. Um, controls. Yeah, look. Optifine is installed. We've got boost key, a zoom key. Um, boost is. Uh, oh, this is this is kind of this is something you should actually look at your controls, because um, the boost key. And the zoom key should be different. I'm going to put... Yeah, I'll do that later. Zoom is Optifine, zooming in, uh, control. The boost key is something to do with industrial craft. Your boots, the, the really good boots have a, uh, a speed enhancement thing on them. And that's, yeah, so that's that. So the mods are done, and that's it. We can quit. Comes back, and we're done. You could log into my server uh, when it's modded, and you can connect. Congratulations! What? So, in the end, um, I just wanted to say that yes, uh, you will have to do this or or mod your client manually, you know, the old-fashioned way. Um, but you will not be able to log into our server vanilla any longer. Okay. So, all right, guys. Short video. Thanks for watching. Later.